What's up, Baz Babes? It's your girl Joy back with another thing. I'm super excited because, you know, I don't get a chance to go shopping very often. You know, like, you know, you just go all out shopping. Money's not an option. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I go shopping on my type of budget. But let me tell you, I'm about to show you my haul. Yes, it is a Walmart haul. I'm telling you. I don't want to offend anyone. This is what I do. This is how I dress. This is my look. These are the sizes that I choose. It is what it is. You do what works best for you. I'm going to do what works best for me. But with that said, I'm going to show you my Walmart haul. Everything that I picked up today was three dollars. Hunty, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, sis. You bet. Look, let me show you how I hook up my Walmart, uh, my Walmart clothes. Cute. I'm, I am going to pair it with things that I already have. So, sis, I will give you six different looks <laughs> with my three dollar haul. And honey, you better go to the clearance section. Go right to the clearance section. Do what I do. Okay, let me show you what I put together. Let me show you what I put together. Let me get ready to show you my first look. So this is the first look. I know I'm kind of far away. You can do it with heels. This sweater is like my cozy sweater. And I put it on with some jeans and a belt. You gotta do the tuck in the front. And I threw it on with my little wedge heels. Right? Or you can take the same outfit and pair it with some cute little sneakers, some cute little stretchy pants. You can wear it long. This you can even wear as a skirt. I mean, as a dress. You can wear it as a dress, but I prefer the top in the front and you get the back out. And if you have a jiggy belt, then you wear your belt and tuck it. So you can wear it out. You can wear it as a dress. But the secret is, for me, it works for me, this is my style. I always go up about four or five sizes, and I like the oversize, it's comfy, it's cozy. Three dollars, and I left the price tag on here. This is a, um, a 2X. So this is the knee, this is how the bottom looks. Or you can take the pants and you can roll the pants up, depending on what you're doing. Throw it on with some little flip flops. You see how you can make it look cute? Make it cute, sis. But then you got the oversized. See how cute? And the oversized. And one thing you better not do, you better not dry it. <laughs> so this is how this feels. I'm about to show you lick number two. Three dollars, honey. Three dollars, okay? Seriously. Now, this sweater is my favorite because I don't do much color. Three dollars, this one didn't have a price, but it was three dollars for this sweater. And I just put on different bottoms and just rock it in a different way. I'm grown, so my shorts can be short, okay? Okay? And I like to show a little leg, you know, and my little heel. You know, sometimes I don't always do the tomboy thing. The great thing about me, I can cross over from tomboy to film. So they kind of call that something. <laughs> I can cross over. <laughs> and I like crossing over because I don't want to be boxed into a category. <laughs> so this is this sweater. I love it. It feels soft. It looks like it's very good quality. It has different patterns and so on and so forth. So this is this look. If I go back, I still tuck. I had these shorts for many, many, many years. And uh, these are the shorts. If I go further back, you know, I'm rocking it with my little heels. Okay, look, look, okay. And then if it gets hot, I just roll my sleeves up like this. And this sweater is a 2X, same size. This is still a 2X. If I was, you know, when I wash it, I'll lay it out to dry. Do not put the stuff in the dryer. So, and I, and I love this look right here, honey. And I can take this same outfit and throw it on with some cute little sneakers, some little tight pants. So I think I have two other pair of pants. You can wear any of these sweaters that way. Here's another look if I felt, if I, if I feel in this way. When you add the shirt around your waist, it just adds a whole nother dimension to your outfit. 
And something like this, I might wear with heels, I might throw it on with sneakers, and you just tie it around your waist. It just adds another layer, another element that I like. If you want to be a little nerdy, you can take it and wrap it up here too, boo. You can do that too, boo. ready to show you look number three three dollars three dollars just go up another couple of sizes that's it even if you're a big girl and you thick with two c's you can still rock the same look okay does everything need to be skin tight for me i like the mystery underneath the stuff sometimes i like to show a little midriff but most of the time i don't Plus, my shape by E, and I just did a mop on too, honey. I would have to suck it all. Yes. All right, here's look number three. Okay, I love this look. It's a lot of fun. This sweater is also a 2X, and excuse my little stress, okay? So, this sweater is fun, it's baggy, but this is how I put it together. This is what I did, okay? So, you got it, got your little bag. Is she cute? She cute, right? She cute. So you got your little bag. Okay, let me explain this one. Okay, let me let me let me go all the way to the bottom. So this sweater is like a I don't know peachy. It's like a peachy color. I'm not sure. Um, even my shorts, I don't like certain shorts. I don't like tight. So these shorts, I don't know what size they are, but I'll check before. I'll check. But these shorts, these are a little baggy. I bought them a little bigger because I wanted that baggy look. Or I like to wear my stuff on my hips. I don't like high-waisted stuff. So I like this look. I still have the same little shoes on. And I like the baggy look. If I get hot, I can just pull the sleeves up. It has holes throughout the sweater. So it gets a lot of um, breeze. Like if you're out on the beach and then at nighttime you can just throw the little sweater on but you're not suffocating because it has little breathing holes in it. Got your little bag, put your little cell phone up in your cute little bag. Now, this right here, I would rock this style a lot back in the day. I haven't done it in a minute. But sometimes I like to go to the thrift store and get funky ties and stuff like that. And this is a tie. This is, you have to tie it a certain way to get this look and then I tuck the end of it in here or you can leave it out for the cute look like that. So it depends what you wanna do, okay? So this is a tie and sometimes I like to do that but it kinda had a similar color that was in the sweater. So that's why I put the tie on or you could just rock it with a belt. And this is this look. I love it. Three dollars? Look. Three dollars. And keep in mind, this same look, I could throw on with sneakers. So let me see, what sneakers do I have down here? Because I'm not going back upstairs. So let's see how it looks. I'm going to show you how it looks with a pair of sneakers. Same look. Now it's more sporty. It's more of a sporty look. So it doesn't have to be a heel, it depends um, what look I'm going for. Remember, I cross over both sides, baby. <laughs> All right, so let's go for look number four. And I want you to tell me your favorite look. Look number four is next. Now with this sweater, it is so soft. I wish you guys could feel this one. This is also a 2X and it was also 
three dollars <laughs> oh my gosh it is so soft guys and this one is baggy enough it depends on the sweater it's gonna have a different cut i like that you can drape this one off the shoulder or you don't and I, oh my gosh just the softness of this one is incredible so this is this look this is number four i kept the same bottoms on got my little purse this time this is another look baggy and this one you could probably wear as a cute little dress you know cute little dress okay now these shoes i don't really make my nerves bad make me feel a little bit like grandma but <laughs> i do have them i don't wear them very often i just i don't know this i don't know but it kind of looks cute with this outfit stretchy pants you could do stretchy pants or something you could do a stretchy pant or you're going to the beach maybe like a cute little mini see if I was to wear this as a dress honey I'll have to have my heel on a heel honey and this is another secret you see how long this sweater is if you have a big bracelet, you put the bracelet on the outside of the sweater. It gives it a whole nother look, a whole nother dimension. So, that's this look. Okay, so this is look number four. There's two more looks. Stay tuned for look number five. Remember, tell me which look you like the best. I mean, it's kind of all the same, baggy top, different bottoms, but how you put it together can make the world a difference. Okay. So look number five. So guys, what I like about this look, this sweatshirt, like I say, different designs are gonna have a different cut. This is a 3X. And let me tell you, you wash this one time, this is gonna shrink. So even for the shrink factor. So this is a 3X, is nowhere near as big as the other shirt. Um, I do like it, it's a sweatshirt. It says, escape the ordinary. Okay, this is look number five. And I like it, the material is super, 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 super duper soft. Um, you can pull it off the shoulder a little bit. It can go off the shoulder, it's a little tight. You know, like different shirts, different legs. I don't know, this my shoulder right here. It's not even my tattoo shoulder. This my, this my off the shoulder shoulder. <laughs> so you can do that. And I just put it on with some smaller jeans. I think one of Sydney's friends left these jeans several years ago. Cause I asked Sydney if they were hers. I asked Bobby if they were hers several years ago. So they're like little tiny jeans, but it has a good stretch. <laughs> and so this is how I dress this. Well, the thing is when you have a sweatshirt, throw it on with a pair of heels. Why you can't throw on some heels? Or I can put this, this sweatshirt on with the jean shorts that I have and some heels. Sometimes I like to rock a little heel and show a little leg, okay? And I will say this, up to my mother's death, she always wore good heels. She wore slingbacks. So I have an affinity for slingbacks. And she had good legs too. Up to the end, she wore a good heel. She loved to show a leg, honey. Yes, she did. So this is this look. I just threw it on with a little pair of jeans. I don't wear fitted jeans too often, but sometimes I throw these little jeans that I found in the house. And um, But if I was to buy a pair of pants with a little stretch that fits, it would be a size um, three, four. Some one, twos, but three, four, but the clothes that I normally wear, they're probably seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. I could wear it just about any size, as long as I got me a belt, child. So this is this size. Got my earring in here. And I want to show you how this looks with the um with my little jean shorts. So I'm gonna come back. We still gonna say this is five and a half. The next one's gonna be five and a half. This is my little shoes. I don't have many shoes. I just.
just have a few pair. Shoes are not my thing. This is just to show you that you can take a casual shirt and you can throw in the heels and it, and it takes it to a whole new element, you know? So I just wanna show you that very quickly. And this shirt is kinda like a, it's kinda gray. The sleeves, the cuffs are yellow and the waist yellow. Forget it about it. Forget about it. Everybody's staring at us, but she doesn't like them. She loves her heels. She wants to be taller. But when I wear my heels, and if I'm showing a little leg, people stare. <laughs> All right, so this is five and a half. This is my little shorts, and this is how you can take something that's kind of sporty. Do the oversized shirt. Do the oversized shirt. Small girl, big girl, medium girl, it's still gonna be cute, sis. You wanna rock whatever you have and make it cute, make it yours, and work with your confidence, honey. I show a little leg, honey. I just be stepping, 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 honey. Yes, yes, uh-huh, all right, yes. Thank you, darling. <laughs> yes, step. Work your stuff, sis. Yes, baby girl, baby girl. Just work you, boo. Okay. This is the last look. I think it's another sweatshirt. And I'm gonna show you this look. And it'll be last look. So this will be look number six. Three dollars, honey. Three dollars? Baby girl, this sweatshirt is so soft once again. And how something feels makes a big difference to me as well. And this is this look. I did something special to it and I'll show you what I did. I put the little uh, beige shorts I had on. These shorts actually, that I told y'all I'll find out the size. These shorts, let me show you. These shorts right here, these are size large from Forever 21. But you see if I was to pull them up to where they go, they're pretty, they're pretty big, they're pretty big. <laughs> But I, but I wear my stuff on my hips, and I do need a belt, but I wear my stuff on my hips, so, but if I was to wear them regular, yeah, they would be too big, but if I wear them on, it, on my hips, that's how I prefer to wear my things. And look at this sweatshirt, super cute. If I wanted to do this, I could. There's a way to get this look, and I will let you know how I did that. And if you had, and if you had on a high waisted pants, and you had a little summer like I do, I just did a full muck on. Okay, I did a full muck on. But if I know I wear my, if I, but if I wear my belly out, I probably monitor what I eat because my stomach does poke out when I eat, um, especially if I if I've done a full muck on. Okay. And the way to achieve this look, you wear a sports bra or a really tight bra. And then you just tuck it right underneath. You have to tuck it right underneath the bra. But if not, you just pull it out. But I wouldn't need a belt. And I would just do my regular tuck. It depends what look you're going for. I can wear the same look with jeans, or I can throw it on with some sneakers. But it's just when I can get cool at night or wherever you are. I'm telling you, it's wonderful when you have that cozy big shirt. It's almost like putting on your boyfriend's sweater, their big sweater or their shirt or their t-shirt. It's that same cozy feeling that you get. Okay, but it's yours, okay? <laughs> so this is this look. Oh, and I do, just do my little heel back on. Honey, sometimes I'm in the mood for a heel, okay? I'm, I'm in a mood to be six feet tall, sis. Yes. Or oh, I can throw on a cute little sneaker. All right, guys. So this is 
look number six. Let me know what your favorite look was. Was it all of them? <laughs> was it two and four? Or was it one and six? So you let me know. I hope you enjoyed this $3 Walmart haul, honey. Yes, I had me a good shopping spree. This was a shopping spree for me, honey. I had a good time. You know, price was not an issue. So I got six shirts, so I spent less than $20, honey. And you saw all these looks that I done served you, honey. You can switch it up with different bottoms, too. And if you into the skirts, don't throw in a skirt, boo. Yes, yes, what? Or you can even take, or you can even take the same looks and, and throw a belt around the waist. What? What? I forgot to do something like that. Throw a little cute belt around the waist. Should I do that for you real quick? No, I'm not gonna do that. Just imagine, throw a belt around the waist. And there you go with another, yet another look. All right guys, give this video a thumbs up. Leave your comments below. Tell me which outfit you enjoy the most or you like the most. And uh, let me know if you like these types of hauls. Look, they will have to be on discount, okay? Something I can afford, okay? Seriously, but this was a cute. I was like, oh, I felt like I hit the jackpot today, honey. Yes, I did. All right, guys, I love you. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, share, and subscribe. And hit your post notification so you don't know next time I upload a video. Whenever that will be. I don't know.